make you feel sometimes? Uh, sometimes it actually makes me feel very uncomfortable. But like, you know, I feel like what am I supposed to do? I don't want to get involved in you know, their friendship. <laughs> okay, do you, um, do, you, do you feel that Natalie's feelings are warranted? I mean, to tell you the truth, I can't blame her. You know, it's, it's natural. If, you know, if she's being too flirtatious, you know, I can't blame her for getting jealous. Okay. Now, there's a night that happened. Um, Natalie, tell us about the 4th of July. You have yeah. some suspicions. Yes. Me and Danny always keep in contact. Every Thursday, says guys, and I go out with Olga. She's my best friend, supposedly. That <laughs> night, <laughs> she goes out, rain or shine, no matter what, all the time. She was supposedly sick. And my boyfriend wasn't answering the phone, and I want to know the truth. About 4th of July. Yes. So she was sick, and he was out. Yes. And you want to know, were they sticking out together? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, do you guys think that they did something on the 4th of July? Yeah. Okay, well, you know who knows the truth? The lie detector. We'll be right back. Up next. Were you and Danny together on the night in question around the 4th of July? No. We are with people who are so sure they're being lied to that they want their loved ones to take a lie detector test. So, Natalie is sure that her, what she says, her supposed best friend Olga is doing more than texting Natalie's boyfriend. So, Olga is su subjecting herself to the test. <laughs> Let's take a look at the first question. Sit perfectly still when I test you. Okay. First finger. Answer yes or no. This is going to begin. Have you ever flirted with Danny? No. Okay. The flirting question. The results show that Olga is. The results show that she's lying, Natalie. What do you want to say about that to Olga? This is something that I've known, but if it went past that, my relationship with you guys are both done. Oh. <laughs> so, Olga, the test said that you were lying, that you do flirt. Okay, so if I came across that way, I'm sorry. So it's not if I came across that way, I'm sorry. No, you have flirted. It's not, it's not her perception of. It is the truth. It is your truth of what has happened. So the apology would be, I will not flirt anymore. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, let's check out the next question. Do you have any romantic feelings for Danny? No. The results show that Olga is not lying. I told you. I told you. Well, I think even if she doesn't have romantic feelings, it doesn't justify that she's texting my boyfriend and calling him babe. just because you don't want him doesn't make it okay that you bend over for your napkin like that. <laughs> she's still doing it. I don't want him, but look, that doesn't make that okay. Does it? That doesn't make that okay. Exactly. She's like, get off my man. Yeah, exactly. So that doesn't make that okay. Do you understand? It's yes. not about the intention, it's about the action. Yeah. All right, let's move on to our last question. Were you and Danny together on the night in question around the 4th of July? No. The results show that Olga is... <gasps> not lying. <laughs> Natalie, you know what? I just saw you, and when that answer, not lying, came, you put your hand to your stomach. I felt sick to my stomach. I can <laughs> tell. So they were telling the truth. 
I feel relieved about that, but I just think everything is so inappropriate and I want it to change. I hope this makes a change, so just because I'm serious. a little bit of time not spent around your friend may be a little healthy yeah because because uh, we're all saying that Olga is so bad the blonde and the pink <laughs> but you are just as bad to me because you're allowing this person a negative person in your life you know what I mean yeah, yeah I it's like it's about the self-esteem and how you feel about yourself and maybe you don't feel so good so you're allowing her to treat you how you feel and you are great girl gorgeous bodacious big chested looking fine <laughs> and over there either. Yeah, I feel like I'm innocent. I'm a victim. No, you're not a victim. <laughs> you are not a victim. You need to stand up for your woman. And if somebody is inappropriate, because this will be the last one, just stand up. You know? And say, yo, Olga or Nancy or Linda or Susan <laughs> or whoever it is, you need to back up. Like, that's not cool. You're making me feel very uncomfortable right now. Okay? And then reach to your woman and say, I love you, baby. And it's all about you. Yes. Stand up and show the world how much you love Natalie right now. <laughs> oh. Oh. We'll be right back. one way or the other, even if it means taking a lie detector test. Estrella says that she's worried her boyfriend Epi's interest in taking sexy pictures of her may have gone too far. Whoa. So he's taking sexy pictures of you. So I understand there's a body part he loves. What's that body part? The legs, the backside. He loves the booty and the legs. Yes, very okay. much. Okay, and so he's, he's, he's been taking sexy pictures of you for a while now? Yeah, we've been together for about six years. Um, shortly after that, I learned that he was into the backside, the legs, um, sexy clothes, picture taking. And I'm all for it. I mean, don't get me wrong, so I agreed. You like it? Yeah, yeah, I don't mind you it. Like the picture it. taking, the sexy. So I he just asked expected to be... it to stay between us. So, so he, he, he likes to take pictures of you in shorts, right? Yes. Um, and tell me, you, you, you have a sewing machine, Epi? Yeah, I, I bought it just to, uh, to make Daisy Dukes for her so they could be... <laughs> at, at first, I would cut them, they'd be shredded. You know, I looked a little trashy, so I wanted them to look a little presentable to wear in public. So I went out, bought a sewing machine, and started sewing them up. You, know, you, you like, sew them yourself? Yes. So you're up there like... He is. Because this is your thing that turns you on with your woman. Well, they say you want, it done, you want something done right, you got to do it yourself. So... <laughs> in my life. No? I've never heard of a man sewing his woman's sexy stuff. Wow. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so, but you have a worry. You worry that he'd love to take these pictures of you, but he was doing what? Well, um, I'm afraid that um, because the pictures are so um, graphic and explicit, the shorts are rather short in some of them, um, I'm a counselor and a case manager, so my reputation in my community is huge. To be seen, especially on the internet, would ruin me and that's what i'm afraid yeah. of is and that it's, more, it's more sexy than that picture we just that saw. actually was extremely conservative that was his weekend that's conservative yeah. that Whoa. was his weekend okay that so, was his weekend so the internet ones are like bang bang chicka 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 you got okay. it yes and then tell me like about the the you're concerned that there's also some video going on well, um, my four-year-old daughter came in the living room looking for the cat. Um, she looked under the entertainment center and found a camera. Um, when he heard her asking me what it was, he rushed in, grabbed the camera, and was like, oh, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. I'm like, what is going on? So with the programs that I found on our computer and the new things that he's learning on the, the computer, I'm just extremely worried that it's led to websites and posting them. And, and you have, do you guys have a nanny? We have a nanny cam. Okay, explain how the nanny Cam came into the life when you don't have a nanny. 
Well, um, we have a huge computer room, so he puts all his um, stuff in there, and I noticed him bringing in some nanny cams, extremely small nanny cams, and I'm like, what are those for? Um, but he brushed me off, I brushed it off, and I've actually never got an explanation for what we need him for. It leads me to believe they're going to be put on the internet. He's like secretly taping me. Like he's secretly